So I have almost immediately thought of something to add to our hypothesis and thought experiment, and that is this. The mysterious energy that uh, prevents entropy in you as an individual is love, but that introduces a difficulty <clears throat> in English that I think you need to be aware of, and that is that English makes it possible to think in terms of stasis. The things are solid and unchanging over time. And see, that's simply an illusion. There's nothing in reality that is like that. So, you know, you'll say to yourself, God, am I stupid? See, that's a, a label of uh, permanence, stasis. And no, you did a stupid thing once. You might do it again. In fact, you might repeatedly do stupid things, but you are not stupid. Um, okay, so in English, we speak of love like it's some permanent condition. It is not. It's too bad we can't like do away with the word love and replace it everywhere we would have used it with the word loving. Now, <clears throat> a characteristic of Hebrew is that every noun in Hebrew has as its root a verb. So, for example, my name Nathan in Hebrew is Natan, which can mean gift but it is also the verb he has given. So, uh, I suppose, I'm not sure, but I think Nathaniel means both a gift from God and it means God has given, or maybe God is giving. So, uh, in English, the closest we have is we speak of a building, but because we're locked inside the paradigm that is English, we see the building as a solid, static phenomenon. We don't see it as a verb, the verb building. So, love, see, I'm going to say can't exist. There isn't any such thing as a permanent, static thing called love. What there is, is loving. And you can't get love. You can't find love. What you can do is get out there in the world and pump love along. Move it along through you. So consider yourself to be a love pump. You are loving. You are seeking loving, which is both that you're seeking to be loved, but seeking to love. And so that's a big part of this mysterious external energy input that keeps you away from personal entropy, moving toward warmth and lightness and celebration. So get out there, all you love pumps, and do your pumping thing. <laughs>